Welcome back, 47. Your targets are two members of Liberation, a doomsday cult planning an attack in Bangkok, specifically cult leader Oybek Nabazov and his second-in-command, Sister Yulduz. The client, a reclusive millionaire operating under the codename Loxley, has provided evidence that the cult is planning to unleash a bioweapon somewhere in the city. Masquerading as a self-help group, the cult is at the Himapan Hotel, hosting an art exhibition entitled A Study of Life, Death and Rebirth, Viewed Through the Lens of Atrocity. Chilling when you consider their plan. Additionally, I have learned that a small group of potential cult recruits is present, which may provide an opportunity to infiltrate. I'm worried about this 47. The cult plan is in its final stages. The sooner we disrupt it, the better. I shall leave you to prepare. Forty-seven, Diana here. Listen closely. We've got an emergency on our hands. I'll have to brief you en route. Improvisation is part of the craft. Go on. When we eliminated the targets in Bangkok, it appears we misjudged what the cult was capable of. I misjudged it. This should be interesting. Yes, well. I'm afraid eliminating Nabazov activated a ring of sleeper agents. My current theory is that the network signal spike in Bangkok was a go signal, something automated. A kill switch? Who are the targets? So far, we've identified two cult members meeting in Sapienza to exchange a viral weapon. Something, and I quote, apocalyptic. The client asks us to eliminate them both and extract the weapon. Very well. Give me the details. Your first target is Craig Black, renowned author of the Cassandra Snow franchise. He's hosting a late night book reading in the Sapienza Church, a VIP event, invitation only. His publisher has spared no expense, so expect on-site security. The second target is Brother Akron. Intercepts indicate they will meet at the stroke of midnight to hand over the viral weapon. It is highly likely that Craig Black will leave Sapienza once he has the weapon. Plan accordingly. The client requires that you retrieve the weapon. Intel indicates it's small and easily moved, but be careful with it. A pickup team will be ready when you extract. I've uploaded the rest of the information. Let me know what you need, and I'll make sure it's ready when you arrive. So, Colorado next. That's correct, 47. ICA Intel has just confirmed the exact coordinates of the US-bound signal from Nabazov's dead man's trigger. It's remote. Sounds perfect. Quite. We've borrowed an NSA satellite, and so I'm looking at the location now. It appears to be some kind of paramilitary compound, but intel is limited. However, we do have a positive ID on another of Nabazov's disciples, a medical doctor with a live sample of the Nabazov virus. Small place for a dispersal. Maybe just a test. Or an act of desperation. We cannot allow this to spread, 47. I'm uploading a full briefing to your laptop. Review as soon as you can. All right, 47. Your primary target is medical doctor and radical cultist Bradley Payne. Intel confirms that Payne has already infected a number of unsuspecting militia operatives with the Nabazov virus. Initial examination of the virus show it to be incredibly infectious and utterly lethal. Fortunately, there is no indication that the virus has spread beyond the compound. However, in order to prevent any contagion, pain must be eliminated, along with any infected mercenaries. To remove the risk of exposure to the virus, we're recommending you go long range for this one. I will be providing intel upon touchdown, identifying targets for you once you've set up your sniper nest. Good luck, 47. Good work in Colorado, 47. I hope you've managed to get some sleep on your Trans-Pacific flight. I'm fine. As always. Well, as you've guessed, you're en route to Japan. 
We've intercepted a memo indicating that local authorities have detained a man suspected of carrying an infectious disease and shipped him off to a medical facility further north. Another cult operative. That has been confirmed, yes, but even better. We believe this man is the one responsible for the development of the virus itself. His last known whereabouts match the final set of coordinates set by Nabazov's dead man's trigger. It appears he was headed for Sydney, Australia, but his arrest put a stop to that. That was fortunate. Luck has little to do with it. Passengers noticed him performing some sort of religious ritual in the airport lounge and got nervous. Police detained him for further questioning when he started showing signs of illness. Standard protocols kicked in, and he's now en route to Hokkaido. The mission briefing will be available for review in a few moments. You have two targets. First, Owen Cage, the rogue viral researcher responsible for the weaponization of the Nabazov virus. Cage was moved to the Hokkaido Gamma facility by Japanese authorities. All evidence indicates that he infected himself, intending to become patient zero. He is currently being kept alive in isolation by your second target, Klaus Lieblied. An Ether Corporation scientist, Dr. Lieblied is trying to extract as much information about the virus as possible before Owen Cage dies. We cannot allow Ether to succeed in reverse engineering the virus and profiting from it. Your task is simple, 47. Contain the virus by eliminating Cage and Lieblied. Whatever happens, the Nabazov virus must be destroyed. We must contain it here, no matter the cost. I'll leave you to prepare. 